I think my toddlers can smell fear. Hey everybody, I'm Kelsey. I'm single, so we thought it would be funny if I tried the 100 baby challenge. It's a challenge in The Sims 4 where you have a matriarch and they are supposed to have 100 children, all with different parents. There is a lot of rules to this challenge, so if you're interested, the link will be below. Last time, we had 60 babies. I'm very proud of us. It's been almost a year, and now we're up against our greatest foe, toddlers. We will make it through, we always have in the past. You might have heard of cuffing season, don't know her. I'm talking about cozy season, the season where you bundle up and play video games alone because the weather outside is frightful and inside there is Wi-Fi. Oh man, that's a lot of toddlers. And also my quirky girl. I love Phoebe's kind of hippie look. I want to lean into that more. So I think I'm going to give Phoebe a makeover. No, I'm not avoiding taking care of my toddlers before I even started the game. Let's go plan an outfit. Uh, I'll just look at what's going on. This Todd's going to bed. You should go to bed. You going to bed? You should go to bed. You're eating a salad. That's a good call. All my Todd's are doing what they need. While well, Phoebe figures out her teenhood. Yeah, I love this top part. The rest of it doesn't go. So let's go into outfit category and let's look up boho. Yeah, yeah, okay. Oh, that matches so nicely. I never used this one. Oh, we could do it in blue. Oh, that's cute actually, I like that a lot. I think these might've been kind of like what she was wearing already. That's cute. Oh, this one's nice too. Like it in the, I like it in the neutral. That feels very boho. Oh yeah, that looks cute. It's got like blue and pink in it, which is like kind of her headpiece. Let's get her some bracelets and stuff. Like a blue vibe, yep. Ooh, I like these beads. I think this is our Phoebe. Our Phoebes. Our future evil queen. Wait, there's new clothes. Actually, I know that there's new overalls. Let's change this to some new clothes. Yeah, new overalls, baby. Oh my God, yas. This is feels a little Casey. It's a little sporty too. I like that. And we'll do like a little sporty shoe. Aw, she's got a new, wait, are there new haircuts? Oh my God, Casey, you look so good with this little bit. Oh. I don't think Case rocks that look. I think that looks for another gal. Yeah, I like this one. Okay, Casey looks adorable. He's so cute. Okay, check. Well, thank you so much for being a part of Kelsey's Extreme Sim Makeover. I'm your host, Cozy Kelsey. Okay, what is happening? Let's see, Casey. Looks like she's feeling pretty good. How is she doing with her public image? She's halfway through a notable newcomer, so I feel like I really just want her to keep that up. So add to your Instagram story like a lot. Look at her Phoebo. She's feeling sleepy. Autumn is very sad. Autumn, why don't you take a nap? Actually, Autumn, you're like hungry. So why don't you, instead of complaining to your mom, get like a nice little meal. Grab a serving, okay? Ready? And break. Oh, Casey's updating her Instagram followers on her latest uh, babies that she has. Oh my gosh, best image ever. Good job, Casey. Go jogging for a total of two hours. She's never done that. And she also hasn't spent 10 hours exercising, apparently. I'm kind of surprised about that, but. All right, I think she should post updates reply to some comments. And then I want her to maybe like begin a stream and then go jogging. That'd be fun. Autumn is just a helpless toddler. She needs a caregiver. Her caregiver's busy. Ooh, who's this guy? Excuse me, sir. I mean, she's already met like a ton of Fred Jensen. He's got like such a nice head of hair here. He's got like that five o'clock shadow, long jacket, boots. Yes, King. Why don't you, I mean, She's going jogging. Oh my God, there's her ex. So awkward. Oh, she had 4,000 followers. Good job, Casey. And she went jogging for a total of two hours and she got a lot thinner. That was random. <laughs> oh, Autumn is very sad. Well, why don't we give a bubble bath to little Autumn, who also is awake. It looks like August is awake. August is gonna have like a nice little meal. Good job, Autumn. All right, and then after that, Casey, I would love it if you, oh, you can't potty train because you're too tired. All right, well then sleep. Poor August. I'm so obsessed with Autumn that we really don't give August appreciation. He is also 
you know, a somewhat auburn blue-eyed baby. He's quite cute as well. And oh my gosh, just as mom got to bed, Mars is crying. All right, mom, get back up. And August is having a great old time. That's the key to Todd Mageddon in survival, is like making sure all your Todds are sleeping at once and just pull one out at a time, really. Come on, come on. Yeah, level two, good job. Oh, looks like Connor has woken up. Poor mom just really can't get a break, to be honest. Here's Evil Phoebe. Oh, and her little, I, for, I forgot that this towel thing was backless. I actually love this. What, mom, why didn't you fix this? Connor's still upset. He is from Cyberlife. Lucian's hungry, feed him before he dies. There you go, Lucian. Where is Lucian? Lucian's asleep. Come on, Lucian. Wow, he's stinking up a lot for someone that's not quite needing hygiene yet. Oh, Connor is still upset. Dude, Connor, what do you want? There you go. I'm gonna make mom wake up and potty train. You can sleep when you're dead, Casey. Owen is very hungry as well. Oh no, Owen just woke up. Luckily, I leave a garden salad in the Todd room. There you go. Oh my God, they're all awake at once and I'm stressing. Lucian's getting potty trained. Phoebe is doing her homework, which is good. She's 50% done. She does need a skill to level three. I feel like she should read a book, but a special book about vampires. Lucian just figured out potty level two. Proud of you, sweetie. All right, now he's on level twos on everything. So is Owen, actually. Phoebe's homework's complete. Good job, Phoebes. How you doing, Owen? He's just so sad that he's so alone in the world. But it's okay, you can chat with your brother, okay? Unlocked vampire tome. Good job, Phoebe. Oh my gosh, it's almost their birthday. Are you kidding? I just had those babies. I am not gonna have six Todd's. This is terrible. All right, we'll purchase some vampire tomes just for you, darling, and have you read it, because I think you'll enjoy that. I feel so bad for all these toddlers because none of them are really getting all the attention that they deserve. They deserve and need attention, but unfortunately, mom is like about ready to die, and Phoebe needs to do her stuff before school, which is in four hours, but like, I, they all have needs. They all have needs. Oh no, he's so angry. Ah! Oh my gosh, all my children are sad. Mars! Super efficient baby care and then go. I think you need to cook a bunch of salads. I think we're running low anyway. She's not super well rested, but she's not dying. So she's almost to level three. There she goes. Amazing. So now she's done. She's just like up late at night, 6 a.m. reading things about vampires. He really needs attention and hygiene so poorly. And Lucian also needs hygiene. The other two are asleep, but it's fine. Everything's fine. I don't think you can die from bad hygiene, right? She's still reading that book. I think you're good, Phoebes, like for now. Can you give one of your brothers a bath really fast for me, Phoebe? I know you have your own needs. This boy is very sad. He's just the saddest boy. Phoebe starts school in an hour. No, oh, what a good sister. Even though she's evil, she protects her own. You need potty. Why don't you just keep going potty here? I just need you both to grow up. I can't do six of you. I can't, I can't, I can't do it. I know Autumn's upset, but luckily in front of her are a bunch of garden salads. He's sobbing because he's so lonely. All right, this is just really, oh God, and he's mad. Oh no, okay, we need to do a beauty review, but no one's available to do this. They all need attention and they can't, I can't give it all to them. I'm giving you attention right now, aren't I enough? Oh my gosh, they keep finishing salads, I'm so proud. Oh no, August is awake. August is awake and needs attention. Give all your children attention, please. Oh wait, he's sleepy. Go to bed, dude, dude, why are you not sleeping? Oh my God, everybody's upset. Oh no. Casey can only pay attention to like a couple at a time. Oh my gosh, they're talking to each other. Oh, I forgot, they can talk to each other. Oh, but you need to go to bed. What are, what are you doing up? What are you all doing up? You're all tired. Go to bed. Oh my gosh, everyone's going to bed. And they're all asleep. Oh, Phoebe's home. She's just a bee student, but she is a smelly bee student that might pass out at any moment. Why don't you take a brisk shower and then go to sleep in your mom's bed? Who is that? It's Daryl! Casey, wake up. It's Daryl. Go get to know Daryl. He happened to be jogging by your home. I feel like he did that on purpose for sure. Oh my gosh, she just gave him a kiss on both cheeks. Huh? Give him a pep talk. Why don't you like Daryl? Tell him a dramatic story. What do you mean? Oh, he is picking up what Casey put down. Oh no, Connor. Man, Casey, you gotta go fix Connor. What are you doing? 
Don't wake up your sister. Why don't you potty train Owen? That's like not fun for him, but it is like a bonding experience that I think he'll appreciate. Oh my gosh, we cannot have these two children age up before I figure out these pods. No, they're all awake, they're all awake. Oh my God, this is my own personal purgatory. Put him to bed, she's stressed out too. Look how tense she is. I feel you, girl. Okay, we need all hands on deck. No, she's not good either. Deep breaths and cozy blankies, okay. Autumn also needs a bath, and so does August. But also, what you could be doing is sleeping. Why did you all wake up? Did one baby cry and they all woke up? Like, what happened here? Oh my gosh, mom is just tired as heck. Heckin' tired. Go to sleep, mom. We just gotta get someone out of this child phase. Wait, is there someone outside? Who's outside? Who is this? Greg, not Craig? Greg, not Craig is old. He looks like old Craig. And then this is uh, the son. But we never, I don't think she ever had anything with Greg, not Craig. Why don't you get a little flirty introduction? She's exhausted, but you know, it's never too late at night to uh, flirt it up, my girl. All right, Greg is a eligible bachelor. You might as well know him. Oh, it's so awkward for Logan. Logan's like, come on, mom. And she's like, what? I, I heard voices outside. Who is up? Why are you up, Lucian? Wait, is this Greg, not Craig? He, what? Okay, Greg was just outside at Chelsea's grave. That is. Spooky. Oh wow, nobody is okay. Ah, Connor! Please stop talking and finish your homework. There you go, that's the spirit. 25% done, that's not the spirit. Oh, just take care of some stuff. Okay, just watch, watch some TV. Okay, it's fine, everything's fine. <gasps> Chelsea's here! Oh my gosh, is she gonna meet Greg, not Craig? Chelsea, ghost Chelsea. Oh, she's haunting, oh, not the bathroom again. Casey, just flirted up with this old man. Wait, why didn't he like, why isn't he that into her? Was it awkward? Oh, he just left. Okay, she's gonna pass out. Man, I really wanted that to work out. Oh, Chelsea's cleaning up the tome. She's like, I don't want this up. People are gonna see it. There's just so much to upkeep that I can't even do like funny things. Okay, pay attention to this toddler who's throwing a literal temper tantrum. He is enraged. Ugh, Phoebe, please help. Oh no, now someone's awake. No, it can't be Mars and Connor's birthday today. I can't do this, I can't do this, I can't, I can do this, I can do this. We're fine, it's fine. Oh no, why are there always babies crying? Oh my gosh, Casey's spotlight is fading, no! Ah! I wanted to make her famous and now she's even less famous. Oh man. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We're gonna have her post to her Instagram some. Are you eating? Are you calming down, sir? August is going to bed. Oh no, someone's up. Ah, he's hungry. Okay, 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 everything's fine. It's okay, you don't need to be sassy, all right? You've got a garden salad in your inventory. No, all the, all the Todds are awake. All the Todds are waking up, okay. We got this. Whoo, Kelsey, how did this happen? How did this sneak up on us so badly. I have no idea. It's time to go into fight or flight here. Like we gotta just get this en enough. Okay, mom, you can stop posting on Instagram for a minute. The baby's been crying for like a really long time. Okay, Autumn needs hygiene, fun, and attention. We can have her play. Woo! He's getting close. They're getting close. They're just not there yet. Mom is tense. Oh, can she play with like a guy she just met that we're trying to like seduce? Yes, play with Daryl. That's how you get your man. You play online video games with them. What? She's late for school oh no phoebe phoebe's late for school and she's so look how mad she is it's like mom you should have woken me up that's my teenage daughter yeah okay have fun at school darling you better study hard <gasps> autumn Res imagination skill level two that's so good good job autumn lucian how are you doing he's fine just keep pottying when's my daughter come home oh my gosh autumn's up now oh she's getting a bath that's right she's getting attention though oh my gosh i know you're super sad bro yes Level three, okay, okay. He just needs potty and thinking and that's it. Oh my gosh, he's so cool. Lucian, it's potty level three. Yes, Lucian, you get a good job. Can mom teach you something? Okay, I'm gonna pause this, I'm so overwhelmed. Lucian needs thinking. Mom, teach shapes to Lucian right now. Phoebe's home from school. She's got still a B, probably because she 
was late. Ah, Autumn reached communication level three. Good job, Autumn. Go straight to bed. Owen has reached thinking level three. Thank goodness. All right, what does Owen need left? Just potty. All right, potty. Potty it up. Potty it up. Oh, look, I don't care how much attention you need. We got this. We got this. We got this. We got this. This is fine. Everything's fine. I'm fine. It's fine. So soon, my darling, you will be a child and I won't have to worry about you so much. Just, can you just, just a little bit farther, Owen, a little bit farther. Don't be crying, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry, sweet, sweetie, sweetie, it's okay. August is so upset that he might be taken away. Well, get in line. Are you serious? <gasps> no, it's done, it's done. We didn't even just get the notification to celebrate, but Owen is officially good enough to be a child. I am so happy. Oh my, God. mom needs to make a, a cake for him. Why don't we have you go to sleep, sweetie, while we wake up, mom? Autumn, why are you awake? Oh, she can't fall asleep because she's sad. Just go make a cake, please. Please, just go make a cake. I want one less Todd. The Todds might get me this time, honestly. The Todds may be the death of me in this episode. You'd think after 60, I'd get better at this, but I'm not. No, no, you are gonna add birthday candles. No, Connor, it's not about you. I know you're just a baby. I'm yelling at a baby. I don't want this. I didn't ask for this. I mean, I kind of did. I mean, I did say like, I want the 100 baby challenge. Like that was on me, but come on. Go get Owen, age him up, age him up, age him up, age him up. He wasn't even a problem to sleeping, but it's fine. Okay, happy birthday, Owen. I'm so happy you are not a toddler anymore. Pick a number one through four. That would be three. Okay, so he's a motor kid and he's a klepto. Amazing. Great. Great, 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 great. That's one. Oh wait, I did, I was so stressed out, I didn't even notice how cute Owen is. He's so dapper, he looks like a young Clark Kent. Oh no, what if I just woke up? It's the cute one, but still. Why can't you, can you just go back to sleep for me? Can you just, can you do that? Thank you. I don't wanna deal with you right now. All right, she's having some fun. Why don't we? have her teach shapes. That's my good girl, Phoebes. My good evil girl. There you go. Her social's kind of, is his social going up? Oh my gosh, Mars. Are you not pleased? She's giving you attention. Oh, it's cause she's evil. <laughs> she's being mean to him. Oh, Harry came back and he's cleaning out the toddler toilets. All right, he's tired now. Why don't you just go to sleep, my buddy? All right, and you need to do your homework. Oh, okay. You don't need to do anything else with that kid. Who else do I need to age up? This one. All right, he's almost ready to go. Are they talking? Good, they're talking. And your big brother's here too. Look, kid, aren't you happy? Yes. Oh my gosh. Aw. Connor and Casey just became good friends. Good job. Lucian's having a good time. <gasps> Wait, this is the last one. Lucian doesn't need anything else. Come on, Lucian. Ah! Lucian is able to be aged up. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. We will have just gotten rid of two kids by the time that we get two more. What? No, Mars and Connor just aged up. Mars is fussy and Connor is silly. Oh, silly Connor. Mom, what are you doing? Can you just like help blow out candles to Lucian? Oh my gosh. I have so many Todd's. Aw, but Mars got a cute little hat. Oh, and they're chatting with each other. They're pretty cute. They're stressful, but oh, Connor's wearing a cute little skirt. Aw, they just hugged each other. Lucian, stop. Let mom eat you up. Happy birthday, Lucian. Okay, Lucian needs to be fed or else he'll be taken away. I don't care. Happy birthday, Lucian. Autumn is hungry. Everybody's gonna die. Okay, Lucian ate up. Pick a number one through four. It's four. Social, he's a social butterfly and he's a glutton, just like his mom. Happy birthday, Lucian. Oh, he looks handsome, look at handsome boy. Okay, so we still have four Todds. We now have two kids that can help around the house. I have to like hype myself up over these Todds. They're just, they're just so upsetting. Why don't you cook a big party size salad for us? Everything's dirty, disgusting. Oh wait, I have two children now, ha ha. Oh wait, he can't clean that though. He can mop though. That's what children are for, to help with the chores. Owen's got school for the first time. He hasn't done any homework yet though. Do your homework, Owen. Stop cleaning, I don't, I don't mind. Another quick pause, how's everyone doing? His needs are all pretty good. So he can just start on playing the sim shape. Same with you. I find that when I pause the game to 
you know, organize my sims, I don't feel as stressed sometimes, which is good. Okay, he's gotta go to school. And so does Phoebe. Phoebe gotta go to school, my darling. I want you to get out of the house so we can get pregnant. Speaking of getting out of the house so you can get pregnant, Casey is very tired, but once she's not tired, she's gonna invite someone over. Autumn is sad, as usual, but they're chatting together, so hopefully it's better. Buy flowers for everyone. Aw, Owen bought flowers for everybody in his class and they were all really happy. That's so sweet. Oh my gosh. Sensitive, sweet, charming, thought-provoking. These are the few of the descriptors kids are whispering about Phoebe in the halls. She's definitely fooling everybody at school because she is evil. Some say the school bully renounced his previous taxation on school lunches. The popular girls are allowing anyone to sit with them, even if they aren't wearing pink. I see that reference. And nobody has been stuffed into a locker today, and all because of Phoebe's lovely cards that she sent for Love Day. Is this what being a teen legend feels like? Possibly. Oh, we missed that thing that we were supposed to do. Ah, she had like a brand deal, and it, ah, it's fine. It's fine. Sometimes you gotta pick and choose your goals. And right now our goal is 100 babies, and so we can't do the extra stuff right now. Ooh, Lucian's reached social level two. Good job, Lucian. He's all good for school tomorrow, so we'll just have you go to sleep. They're all asleep. Oh my gosh, the entire P.J. Schmay household is asleep. Except for Casey just woke up. Good job, Casey. What? Who's calling? In lab, Owen's science experiment exploded and made a big mess along with frightening another student. We think he did it on purpose. <laughs> Not my Owen. My Owen would never. And then she's gonna call over Daryl. It's time to seal that deal with Daryl. I think that in a couple hours, her daughter's gonna come home and be able to move out. Now, do I wanna move out her daughter? Absolutely not. Tell an unbelievable story. Here we go, Case. Talk about cooking. Can she not eat and like chat with him? She can flirt with him a little bit and eat a salad. No, seriously? Why is he going upstairs? No, no, sir. You are, he's gonna go up on our computer, isn't he? Casey, go up and flirt with him. Bring your salad. She's sitting on her child's bed, but it's fine. Ask about day, and then we'll do another little flirt moment. Owen swiped an object while he was at school. Owen's a C student, but Phoebe's grades are up. Good job, Phoebes. Okay, well, Phoebe, we gotta age you up. And mom is gonna just continue this flirt fest. Aw, happy birthday, Phoebe. I kind of love her, even if she is evil and a bro. And she's also a kleptomaniac. She's gonna make a really weird vampire and I'm proud of her. So now, my darling, unfortunately, we need to move you out. She looks so sad right there. Uh, we need to move her out so we can have a baby. I thought she'd live with the girls. Yeah, she'll live with the girls. Back into the house. Let's get this woman pregnant. Where did the guy go? Here he is. First kiss, yeah. I like that our son came to visit. That's kind of nice. Here we go. First kiss, baby. All right. He's like, oh, what a lovely first kiss in your child's bedroom. And now we're going to try for a baby. Wait, you can try for a baby in a shower? That's new. Okay. I'm very curious about this. He's wearing a lot of eye makeup, I just noticed. Oh my gosh, all my toddlers just got inside the house. Oh, this is new! Our ex is asking us, what? Lucian just walked in on his mom in the shower. Lucian, get out of there! Oh my gosh. Lucian, go to sleep. Go to, go to, get out of here. Autumn, oh my gosh. Okay, looks like they had some fun. Why don't you take a pregnancy test there, girlie? She's eating for two! Congratulations, Casey. She is now pregnant again. She's like, goodbye. This man just like came here, said, okay, I really should be going. Casey's spotlight's fading as usual. Oh my gosh, no, Leo Jr. We don't want to come over. You not understand? We have stuff going on right now. No, bad kid. Okay, that's been, it's been a minute. Oh my gosh, he's having an emotional meltdown. What's this toddler need? Here, oh my gosh, this toddler's making a mess too. Go to bed. I'm gonna have one of my kids come clean it up. Casey, please discipline him and then give him a bubble bath. That is not how you get attention in this house, sir. I know that the attention is hard to come by, but like, it doesn't matter. You are not allowed. He's happy now. Oh, when I got what I want, I'm happy. Ah. All is quiet now in the Petrishme household. Oh, our buddy here. He's taking care of some kiddos. Oh no, she woke up. I really wish I could ask him for 
potty help, but we can't have her do that. Oh, it's gonna be so hard for Casey to get this all done herself. Oh, he's cleaning up for her. At least she has like lovely children like Logan that'll come by and help clean the house. He is upset really over these Todds. I don't want any more Todds. No more Todds, please. Oh, Autumn is very cranky. She can go to bed now. She shapes, yeah. I think the kids can actually teach, which is kind of cute. He's gonna teach you thinking. You guys are gonna hang out. I'm excited to watch this kid teach thinking. Casey, just go to bed. Get some sleep while you can. Lucian's helping. He's such a good big brother. He's teaching! How are you feeling, August? August is not getting any attention from this. Are you kidding me? What do you mean? Oh my gosh, and she just passed out. Oh my goodness, go back to sleep. Love Day was awful, but you had a baby on Love Day. He needs to do his homework and everything, but he needs to be in a better mood before he does it. There he goes, up to level, no. Everyone's getting a phone call. Tegan passed. Oh, now everyone's gonna be sad. All right, good job, Owen. No, not again. Archer just passed. Oh my gosh, everyone's gonna die. Guys, I just can't do this. It won't change the game. I can't auto age for unplayed sims. They're not gonna die anymore, thankfully. Oh my gosh, it's so stressful. Now everyone's sad though. Welcome to the sad era. Oh wait, a kid's up and hungry. Mars is so hungry that he will be taken away. He also, as usual, Say it with me, kids. Needs attention and hygiene. <laughs> Luckily, mom is actually not in too bad of shape. There you go. She's gonna take, give that little baby a bath. Look how Diva. dapper Lucian is, my all-American lad. Yeah. Someone else is wanting us to promote TV dinner. It is too late. We do not have the time. Why are you so sad? <laughs> Sweetie, it's okay. He's waking everyone up. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? Oh no, everyone's awake. I just, I just need a break. I just need a break. I'm gonna travel with her. And you know what? I'm gonna travel with <gasps> Chelsea and Peach Bay. I need something to talk to you about this. August is very hungry. <gasps> I hope he doesn't get taken away while we're out. I just need space for my children. Let's talk about the sunny letter. Hey Chelsea, I think we got off on the wrong foot. Now you're a grandma. We were friends once. I feel like Chelsea's a little judgmental of Casey's lifestyle, which is ironic because she looks just like her mom. She's like, you you have more to you than taking care of toddlers. And she's like, excuse me? Look at her, she's so mad. She's like, I can't believe you would say something like that to me. Oh, imply your mother's a llama. Yeah, be like, oh yeah, you think my mom raised me wrong? Your mother's a llama. You stole my mother's face and you don't look that good. My mother will look awesomer than you. Throw a drink in her face, Casey. <gasps> she just said something very negative about our Casey. I don't know what it was, but it deserves. Oh, Casey. Oh, man. Come on. Oh, she just laughed at Casey. She's going to give her a gift. But it's a fart gift. Ha ha ha. Sucker. That's what you get for ignoring my children and faking your way into our lives. Oh. <gasps> Chelsea just threw a drink into Casey's face. Honestly, she's not worth your time. We're going home. I wanted us to throw hands, show Chelsea who's boss. Chelsea got off scot-free from her age. And she just really like made Casey upset. Look at that, she looks so pained because she needs to pee and is tired and hungry and needs some fun. And that woman's just a nightmare. Just saying if Chelsea doesn't step off, she's gonna get what's coming to her. But I wanna rise above it and maybe there'll be a Christmas miracle. Who knows, we'll find out next time. Next week is episode 50, and it's also the season finale of, not the series finale, but the season finale of season one of the 100 Baby Challenge. We're gonna take a, a little break from the show, just for a little while. I love you all so much, and I'll see you guys next week.